G'day guys, Grumpy Trev back again with another five minute bite and minute review. Today, well, we've got the charger. We've got a 1S six channel intelligent charger to do. So, won't waste any time, we'll whack it on the bench and go through what it can do. Let's go. Well, the construction of this thing is pretty good. I really like the build quality of it. It doesn't look cheap. Uh, it's got your AC input, two, uh, 100 volts to 240 volts. At the other end, you've got your XT60, which will take seven to, uh, seven to seven volts. It is only a 1S battery charger. Um, it's got six independent ports each side with four different connectors. So you've got your micro, MX, MCPX, and your JST sockets. Uh, you've got a nice little status bar here, which uh, I'll flash on the screen in a second. It has adjustable current per each port. So what that means is it'll charge from 0.1 amp to 1 amp on each port. Now we'll plug this little thing in. Pretty straightforward to use. You've got your select button on the left hand side. Press that once, brings up your current, which you can adjust with the right hand button. It'll cycle through from uh, 0.1 amp to 1 amp and cycle back again. Press the select button again and actually brings up the battery type. And you can highlight that. It'll go to LiPo, the high voltage batteries, or you can select one individually. So you can each port will be different and just hold the button down to select that port and it'll save that. So we'll whack a couple of batteries on. One thing I really liked about this charger is the audible notification it gives you beside your green light when the battery's full. Also it displays on the screen that's full. Another feature that, well not really a feature, but another thing this battery charger will do, you can plug a battery into this any time and use it just like a multimeter and it'll give you your full voltage readout so you know whether your battery's flat or fully charged. So that's something the smaller ones won't do. Well that's the end of another five minute by a minute review. I really liked it. I'm not going to chuck this in the bin. I thought it was pretty good value. US, 29 bucks. And Aussie, it's around $41 Australian, as you can see on the screen. Playing around with a new sort of a format video. Let me know if you like it or not. Give us a thumbs up, thumbs down. If you're interested in one of these, I'll leave a link below. That's it. Catch you next time, guys.